everybody, today on Tools in Action, we got a quick sneak peek video for you. This is not a full-blown uh, Tools in Action video, it's just a quick peek at the DCF 620 brushless drywall screwdriver. What's a brushless drywall screwdriver, Eric? Yeah, that's exactly what you said. It's brushless, which means <laughs> brushless motor. And drywall means basically specifically for, you know, drywall or if you're doing other applications like that where you want to even decking or something exactly, like that. Exactly, that's you know? what I was going to say. So. Other applications too, like decking. I yeah. noticed when I was watching a show the other day where they were building RVs mm -hmm. and putting the aluminum paneling on yeah. and they were using one of these. Yeah, it's just if you're going to be driving a whole bunch of fasteners. So yeah. it's, it's great because the way they've got the, a lot of these designed is, I mean, you know, you get the trigger right down here, you can lock it on. Uh, the one thing is the lock button is right down here. This is the forward and reverse, but it's comfortable. So that's what you want when you're driving a whole bunch of fasteners in. Yeah. And, and like Dan pointed out earlier, the, tool, the uh, belt clip. Yeah. What? <laughs> <laughs> well, no, that's what it's yeah. for, so you don't have to go on it. And yeah. variable. Yeah, the belt clip's at an angle, you guys. So. To, for me, it tends to just put the tool in just that right position mm -hmm. where I'm going to need rather than it being all awkward like this. It really does a good job keeping Keep the tool at center, gra exactly. center gravity. gravity. Uh, what else we got? What's this locking collar we got on this, Eric? Well, that's because you can take it off and eventually, I think like you said, that there's going to be a collated... I put yeah, an adapter that's probably going to go on there. I've seen it in Europe. I'm not sure. I mean, obviously, it's going to come out here eventually. Um, but this allows you to go in, change your extension, change your bit, and all that good stuff. Yeah, which is nice because some of them will take a different, <clears throat> the longer bits. Basically, I mean, who doesn't you can, have... You can put the longer bits in here, too. No, I know, but I like the fact that you can use this, too, just a regular... I mean, you got these laying around all over the place. Yeah, yeah. So... You know, you put your number two Phillips in there, square yep. drive, whatever you're running with. And the cool thing I like about it is the actual adjustment. Yeah, it's simple. Right there on the front. Uh, that's it. I mean, it's it's easy to do. You don't have to mess around. No tools, nothing. Yeah. All good to go. Pretty quick. It's going to be around $250, you guys, coming this spring. Is that spring with battery, you think, and all with that? With two 2.0 batteries, uh, a bag, and a charger, I believe. Um, LED light on the bottom. Real simple, quick look, you guys. This is uh, not the final retail version no. yet, but it's just one a tester that we've had. And uh, I got to say, I like it a lot. But... You know, I mean, I didn't really check out the Bosch or anything like that, but DeWalt does have one of these in XRP, the old mm -hmm. XRP NICAD style. And one thing we did learn, because I've never really used one of these guns until we got this, is, you know, just go for it. You know, when you're usually doing a, running a screw with a drill or an impact, yeah, you take you gotta your time get started and, and center it with this, just go. It's just and that's jamming. The, yeah, that's the best way it's going to work out. It's designed for product, for productivity. You Production. Know? Production, thank you. It's right, been guys, a long day. Tools in action. Check it out. Remember, for more exciting tool action, go to toolsinaction.com.